Oh, it's really tough because I'm so, so international with my channels. Um, it's gonna have to be QVC. <laughs> If I was making a movie about my life and I was the one making it, I'd be playing it as well. Hello, money in film. Baby. I would probably go back to just before X Factor, sort of when I wasn't known, and I would have a little whisper in my ear and go, go mad now because this is your last opportunity. <laughs> If it was genuinely that bad, I'd let her raid my wardrobe and I'd have to dress her in something different because there is no way you should let a friend go out looking like horror. Oh, if there was someone in front of me that had like a tag hanging out, I'd go, babe, just let you know your tag's there, do you want me to grab it? That's what you do. So I've woke up on a desert island with nothing but a storm candle. I would wait until it was later. Um, I'd light it to keep me warm and also scent the island really nice. And then I'd try and get in it and paddle my way to another island with people on. What I normally do, just roll my eyes because anything I leave hanging about, Dan or Cameron will have ate it. I don't get nothing. I'm very hard done by. The hair needs to be done. I'd, I'd happily walk around in a creased outfit. Someone will have a steam somewhere. Free course meal. Well, as a master chef finalist, um, I'd probably make, for starters, I'd probably do like a bread of some sort, like a sort of everyone get involved, like dip, share thing. For my main, I'd probably do steak with bordelais sauce and a mustard potato puree. Um, and then for my dessert, I'd probably make like Japanese ice cream balls, which sounds really, really weird, but it like sort of has a skin, but with ice cream in, they're really, really nice. And decorate the table, just my entire Luxenua range, vlog it, go on. Is there? What happened now? Do you know what, I'd probably let them bite me and just join, because it's inevitable, you are gonna get bitten and you will turn into a zombie. So just get it done quick and have a nice time. The outfit I've kept will be a black jumper or shirt, black skinny fits, black boots, because it is my signature look. And to be fair, I probably could give all my clothes away and just keep that, because it's all I wear. I say, Wendy, Steve, I'm not eating it. You know I don't eat fish. And then I'd walk out and slam the door. really tough. I mean, can you stop off at hotels on the way, like for showers and stuff, maybe a little spa day? I just don't think I'd do that. I'm not, I'm not cut out for that life. I've never even been camping. I would be able to fly because traffic makes me feel physically sick, especially when doing shoots like this when they're booked on the other side of London. Mm -hmm.